my role here at the Devonshire Arms was um, to, to obviously lead lead the Burlington restaurant. Um, you know to day-to-day -day running of the restaurant, writing the menus, lead the food and you know, try and drive the food on and, and put my personality and, and, and food style on, onto the, the menu and onto the restaurant. I'm a keen advocate of quality ingredients and it just happens to be that Yorkshire product in, in certain areas is, is some of the best you can get our hands on. Um, th things like you know the grouse and the game Obviously, when I was working in London, you know, these were the things we were fighting for over in London, whereas now it's on my doorstep. I mean, the goal when, when I came to Devonshire Arms, um, you know, the Devonshire Arms got an amazing history of um, accolades with, with, you know, the last two chefs previous to me both been having done fantastically well and, and now being icons in the industry. The likes of Michael Wignall has been an idol of mine for years and then obviously after him was Steve Smith. Um, so, you know, the goal here is to, to gain the same accolades that they had, you know, for the business, for, for our customers and, and for, for myself. It's more about for us, uh, you know, having a busy restaurant, a busy restaurant with people that are actually enjoying it. And for, for me, there's nothing better to go and see somebody after dinner and, and they've enjoyed their meal. That's, in essence, that's why I do what I do, because I, I really enjoy that positive feedback. Um, about afternoon tea, I mean, since I started here um, at the Demonstrate Arms, obviously having I mean, spent such a long time at, at such an iconic hotel like the Ritz in London where afternoon tea is a massive part of what we do. Um, and we don't open for lunch service, so afternoon tea was a sort of natural thing that we could put into there and, and sort of grow as, you know, to grow as a business and, and grow the quality of what we do for our customers. And I think, again, it comes back to all the food that we do. It's, there's nothing too wacky, there's nothing out there. It's just uh, things that are done really well, that things that are done fresh. You know, scones that you bake fresh scones every day. The pastries we make them every day. This, you know, the sandwiches you make into order. That you know, it's, it's just about doing simple things, but doing them really well, so that the, that makes it stand out on its own. So we do we do have a kitchen garden um, here at the Devonshire Arms, um, and it's, it's it's an amazing thing to have. Um, we, we've put a lot of time and thought process into how we can build on that. You know, we're planting over 100 fruit bushes this year. Um, we've planted more than 20 types of herbs that were going into the ground. I mean, this isn't going to work immediately. This is sort of like building for the future with the fruit and the things like that. Um, but the idea is just to, to give us that other, that other dimension to, to our business, really, or to, to our style of food that we can, we can say that we, we have that control over what we're growing, that when we pick it, um, and it's like everything. If you eat a radish that came out of the ground, three days ago to a radish that comes out of the ground three hours ago, it's, it's a totally different product. Um, I think, you know, our, our goal over the next couple of years is to just grow on what we already have. You know, I've, I've been here a year now, so, you know, we've sort of, you know, I've built a team, There's, we've got a strong team around me now, um, with some people that were here previously and, and brought some great people in. Um, and, and luckily, the people that we've all brought in, we haven't lost any, so I think that's a, a quite a positive that, you know, we're getting these young guys to come in and, and, and put the effort in and work hard for us. And the aim is to just to continually grow on the style of food, you know. It's like everybody, your food constantly evolves and hopefully evolves for the better and you can just keep focusing on what you do and, and, and bettering what we do. Uh, and, and again, build our, our client base, build our reputation for, for being a destination restaurant that people want to come and spend the weekend with us and eat with us uh, and, 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 leave, and leave very happy people.